Hello everybody, here we are playing your truck simulator. So we're gonna pick a route on the job market. Uh, let's go. Leon? Why not? Let's drive to Sheffield. So we'll set as a GPS destination. And we'll get in our cab and we'll turn on the engine. Go to uh, pedals, which just need to move, and put in gear and turn off our lights. And we will set off. Whoops, swing round this corner. Okay, let's go. Let's, let's just get lined up and ready to go. Again, not checking the mirrors because you saw what happened. Hopefully we're recording. Oh, come on. Oh, God, what's happening here? We start going backwards. I don't know what happened there. But it doesn't matter. We're going to continue going. And just ignore the speed limit. I think that's what probably what we're doing. Oh yeah, the clock's still on 24 hours. I spoke about this last episode, but I really need to change that because I hate the 24 hour clock. Um, because you have to like, break everything out. Like, if you want to know what 10 o'clock is, you've got to go, oh, what's, uh, what's 1 o'clock? Oh, it's, it's 13. 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22. And you're like, oh, it's 22 o'clock. Okay. And then that's just taking longer than it would if <gasps> you were just on the <laughs> if you were just on the regular um clock, the twelve hour clock, and you just uh, ten o'clock. Oh, it's ten o'clock p.m. Right, I've got you. No need to work anything out. And I'm pretty sure I'm going to collect my cargo now. Or at least I I just oh my god I got a speeding offence I need to slow down I'm pretty sure that's how I remember it to be one sec let me just look at my map yes we're going to the big mine or quarry that is here and I hate going there because I always get lost but we just got a speeding fine well done Matthew or should I say well done Matt BTV that's really bad driving. Yeah, that was really bad driving, and I apologise for that. I wasn't conscious, concentrating, as going too fast. And this truck goes really fast when I'm. Um, this truck goes really fast when I'm not got a trailer on, which kind of puts me off. And I need to decide whether I'm going to upload this in two parts or one part. Because two parts, maybe you don't want to. Because maybe with one part, you don't want to watch, like, not checking the mirrors again. Maybe you don't want to watch, like, an episode for, like, an hour, 30 minutes, or whatever it is. So maybe I should just upload, like, 30 minute segments of it. I don't know, I'll decide later. We will see how long this journey is first, I'm not sure how long it's going to be. We haven't even picked up our cargo yet, and it's already been, what, like five minutes, so... Maybe we shouldn't... Um... Maybe we should be splitting it down. So I said it, like, talk mid-sentence and then stop. Because I'm concentrating on the road. You know, when you're driving, you always have to concentrate on the road. Well, I was just watching the uh, KBC, KBC, yeah, the Korean channel, TV channel, 
FPS. And um, it's like, when I'm recording this, it's like 5am in Korea right now. And uh, the TV, the first thing they like show is this song. I don't know whether it's the Korean National Anthem, I'm not sure it is. But it's like, it goes like, do 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 That was real, like a really bad in tune of it, but that's how it goes. And yeah, I just find it really interesting that they play it. Because in England, I don't think they play stuff like that. They don't play like the national anthem at 5 o'clock in the morning when everyone's waking up. Usually on BBC, there's like a TV show on, or like a preview, and on BBC HD, there's like a preview of BBC HD to like, I don't know, at 12 o'clock. But the thing is, the BBC posts so many channels, there's BBC One, BBC Two, BBC Three, BBC Four, BB two BBC HD channels. And then they've got loads of radios as well. I pressed the wrong button, I need to turn. They've got loads of radio stations as well. There's BBC Radio 1, BBC Radio 2, BBC Radio 3, 4, 5, 6. I think there's BBC Radio 6. And there's BBC And then after 6, you've got all the local radio stations. So there's like BBC Radio Hill, BBC Radio Sheffield, BBC Radio South London. Like, they operate so much. And to be honest, the quality of the programming is extremely good, considering. But enough of me talking about that. We, uh, we've arrived at our destination in a minute of the... Quarry! So we'll just do like a speedy zoom in down this uh, road and try not to crash. Put off the pedal there, move my pedals away. So yeah. Like I didn't say last episode, because of the microphone business, I'm using a wheel at the moment. My wheel's in front of me, pedal's on the floor. So yeah, that's like why the wheel maybe not like moving. In. Oh, I just went completely past that. Time to reverse. And we'll view the job, job, job offer and 41,000 to go to Sheffield. Yes, let's do it. My trailer is ready. Rightio. So let's go down to the... Oh my god. I should have set a timer. I was just thinking about it now. About how I should maybe split this episode up. I was just thinking I should have set a timer. That would have been the most useful thing to do. So then I can stop at half an hour. Now I've got no clue. Like, where I am. And in this game, I have no clue where I am either. I'm just driving around, like trying to get to this. Oh, I forgot to put my indicator blinkers on. I like to do that. Where is my blooming trailer? Down here again? Please say it's down here. I don't want to get lost. That would be very annoying. Oh, here it is. Let's just turn around here. Keep going. Okay, and we're gonna do like a really bad, like jump here, but we try and reverse onto the trailer. Uh, that went pretty well, actually. That went pretty well. Okay, now we have our trailer. We can turn off our... <gasps> oh, we're reversing. I don't know how I forgot that. And we will set off with whatever we have on the back. I've forgotten. Hopefully it's nothing dangerous that if I crash, everyone will die like nuclear weapons in there, like chemicals and stuff. I don't want that, because if I crash then, the whole of Europe, or uh, whoever I'm driving will be... Oh god. Why is this quarry so hilly if they know that 
trucks are going to be coming up here. God, people. Oh, I think this is the wrong way. Yeah, we're going to have to go this way. God, how long have we spent doing this? Blooming trying to get this um, cargo. Exit, please say exit. Oh god! It scared me! <laughs> I just hit something, let's do the damage. Okay, we have no damage, but that kind of puts it into perspective that I need to drive slower and more carefully. God, that scared me! <laughs> Made me jump. Sometimes I get so, like, into this game, like, looking at the screen, that when I, like, crash into something, my body contracts, like, I've actually hit something. And it's about me and stupid things that I do. <laughs> anyway, we're trucking. We're in France. Francais. Je m'appelle Mathieu. Bonjour. Comment t'appelles-tu? Comment tu t'appelles? Speaking of French, a few weeks ago, I had a French assessment. Yeah, I can speak French, and um, I got a star for it, which is like an A plus. Wherever you, if you live in America or anywhere else, that gets this kind of grade. It's a top grade that you can get at uh, high school level. So I was pretty happy with that. And uh, some of you may actually be French, so maybe I'm, I'm not sure. I'm kind of nervous to do this, but I want to ask. <laughs> car, car, car. I want to ask you guys for your opinion of my. French accent. One second. Let me just get this to this junction and then we'll speak. Oh god, I've never known such a busy junction in my whole life. Actually, outside my school, that's like really busy. Okay, we're just gonna like go out and like cover this lane. <gasps> Dead cow, better not. <laughs> Looking at my mirrors and I've hit that car, but. It does not matter. He should not have got so close. And now I see we're just going over it. Okay, rev. We're going to have to rev. No damage caused yet, but I'm pretty sure that we're going to get damage. Okay, there we go. No damage either. Look at that. Pro. Anyway. My French accent. Well, not my French accent. Just the words that I say. Okay, but I'll start. Je me présente, je me forme, j'ai 14 ans, je suis plutôt grande, j'ai cheveux bruns et les yeux bleus. Je viens du petit Camille, il y a ma mère qui s'est pas mine, mon père qui s'est pas Marc et mon frère William. Euh, je pense que je m'entends bien avec ma famille et je ressemble plus à ma mère qui est mon père. That's all I can remember. I know I said something about sports as well, I said, uh, Mon sport préféré est le foot, je me passionne pour le sport d'équipe. Je l'aime car mon avis c'est très amusant, c'est bon pour la santé et je pense que j'en suis fort. J'en fais six fois par semaine après le collège. So yeah, if you're French or if you understood that then, let me know. Recently we've been doing about school and like rules and stuff. Il faut porter la uniforme. Uh, il ne faut pas fumer. Um, stuff like that. Il ne faut pas bavard avec your copans. I don't know what your I know what your is, but I don't know like how the word structure is. Let's just forget I said that. But yeah, we were doing about school and we got I don't know what we're doing next actually. And yeah, then I speak some Korean as well. So, uh, stuff like that. And then, I crashed into that vehicle, and no damage. Oh god, this is why I shouldn't talk and drive. But anyway, Korean, uh, French, we've got Spanish, uh, 
Hola, ¿cómo estás? Me llamo Matías, página 36, capítulo 1, escrito, escrito, la escritura correcta. Uh, yeah, and then Japanese songs like SNSD songs like Watashi no Secret, Shitetana la Homoto wa Sekitu Nintura Kezenai. And um, um, what's it called? Fire Oh yeah, Hikali Te Yami no Mai Nakabi Ken, Dancing Floor, Scream and Shout, Secular Human Nature, Kwasi Sega Matome, Kehiki No Bora, Asobi Des, Kete Tai Koi Ba Asobane. There you go, Japanese, um, Russian. Robert Kupfer, Kukmania. Um, German, Einstein, Jar, Sticky, Sticky, Spinal. That's the song in Grand Theft Auto. Uh, Einstein, Jar, Zick, Shane. Okay, I speak no German. No, no, thanks to yourself. Speak it. Um, okay, what other languages is there that I speak? Um, English, of course. Um, Chinese, Ni Hao, Rowani. Apart from that, no other languages. I have no respect for people who like learn langu- oh, I'm going too fast. For people who like learn languages like fluently. For example, Tiffany from SNSD, she is like completely American. Well, she's not completely American, but she's like. American Korean. She only spoke American and then she learned Korean like fluently and now she knows both and I have such admiration for people like that. Because they have put so much effort into learning the language. And that's why I want to be around and speak as many languages as possible. Because I love, I love learning languages and speaking them. Like I've been in this school all the time she's like, oh we've got French. And I'm just like, I love French. I love learning new languages and everything about like the culture and everything. I guess that's just me. If you're like that, then leave a comment. But most people at my school are just like, oh, French. I don't know if it's because of the teacher or because of the subject. And I think some teachers, like, really detract away from the subject. Like, maths might actually be, like, really good, but because you have a terrible maths teacher, your experience of maths is just being, like, terrible and you never want to do it. My maths teacher is pretty nice, but she shouts at us a lot. Well, she doesn't shout at us, she just says that she's really disappointed in us. Which kind of makes it worse. And then, what else do I do? Geography. I do geography. And I love it. Geography is like, I l again, with like the cultures and stuff, I love knowing where places are. And it really shocks me when like people say, oh, I don't know what the European Union is, I don't know where like Australia is, I don't know where the Philippines are. Like, that just annoys me. You should know. You should know where things are in the world. Or at least know where your own country is. And know something about your own country. So if you don't know where your own country is in the world, then go look at a map. Like, the Europe... Okay, so the European Union is more, like, political, but still, you should know something about your own country. Like, its geographical location. And then, what else? Oh, I took triple science, which is, uh, in English you could do a double award, which is like a lesser science award, or you can do triple science, which is you get a qualification in each three. So that's what I'm doing, biology, chemistry, and physics. I love biology, I love chemistry, and the physics, it's okay. I like it, but that's kind of the one where my teacher lets me down. Then what other subjects is there? Um, oh, I beat it. I take drama and I absolutely adore it. It's the one thing that I absolutely look forward to in a week. And currently I'm helping the... Because you know, it's like a boutique in an EPA group and uh, I think that you only do drama. But with the EPA you do dance, singing and drama. And uh, I'm currently helping them with their exam that's coming up soon. And I have to do the curtain and the music. And if I, like, mess up doing the music, then that's, like, their whole production ruined. And I know, I know what I'm doing, but I've got a script and, like, notes and everything. But I feel I need more practice. It's quite simple. I just open the curtains, like, on points and 
claps indicate when they start and stop with the music and yeah. So uh, yeah, l you guys can comment on what you guys do at school or what you did at school if you're like older than that. Um, what you enjoy, subjects you enjoy, anything like that. Comment on anything, like where you want me to drive to next, what truck I should buy, what load I should deliver, anything you want. Just comment, because I'll, I'll read them all, I promise you. Even if it's not as soon as you post them, I will uh, read it. Or you can send me an email, uh, mattmetv at gmail.com. But please, 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 please put the subject as something like Matt B T V comment or Matt B T V email so I know it's not a spam email and I delete it. If you send me something, then I really, really want to read it. Are you kidding me? Is it raining? I think it's going to rain. And we're going to have to sleep soon again as well. Okay, so maybe it would be an idea to like get to a rest stop, rest stop, rest stop, and sleep, and then you guys can, and then I'll stop the video, and you guys can like wait for the next one. Is that a good idea? Oh, I don't know. You guys won't be able to tell me until I upload this video, and then I would have made the decision whether to go with one part or two. I don't know, because I kind of feel that uploading a video that's over, like, 30 minutes long, that's like a game video, may be a bit boring. But, an hour, would you really want to watch an hour of me playing this? Maybe you would, I don't know. This is like how it's decisions that you have to make. And also I recorded an Awesome Knots video, by the time this is on, the Awesome Knots video will be, ooh, something's going on will be uploaded. So I hope you like that. Comment on that as well. More uh more awesome knots tell me because it's on it's on Steam sale so and I, I hate buying games on my computer that are like full price. I paid for this full price. But I hate buying games that are full price. And it's raining and I think yes it is raining. And my frame rate has dropped because of the rain. Move away! Okay, let's put our lights on. We want to be a safe driver. Oh god, it's traffic lights. Hopefully we can just like wait out the rain and the traffic lights. Yeah, my frame rate has dropped big time. Let's look out the window. Hello! Hello everyone by me! You can see the cars like stopping and starting. Oh god, I hate this. Because of the rain effect on the window, that's like really cool. Ooh! It's... What's the word? It's... Thundering! The thunder in France though, because it's, it's quite hot in France, so when the thunder gets there, you see the lightning strike like so clearly, and I really like it. <laughs> so weird, but I, I really love it, it's like a beautiful scene of this lightning. We don't get that in England, or well, maybe we do, but in summer. And it, so what day is it today? What day is it today? Let me look at my phone. The 22nd of March is today. And guess what? It's still snowing. Because maybe like normal, like Sweden or Iceland or whatever. But not in this country! So what should we talk about now? Technology? Okay, let's talk about technology, Matthew. Okay, Matthew. Uh, so yeah. Which guys are you? Because there's usually two groups of people. Or three groups. The... Apple fanboys. Android fanboys are people who don't really care. And I fit into the group of Android fanboys. Please don't be hating on me. I went into the Apple store and it had like a Samsung phone and I thought I was going to get killed. Uh, but now I have an LG Nexus 4. Google. Pure Google. And uh, yeah. And I absolutely love it. 
It's one of the best films I've ever had. My first film three. Well, that's been. Uh, oh, a Sony Ericsson uh, W350i to begin with. The one with the buttons on the front made for like music. That was a great film. Uh, it wasn't great, it was so bad, but I thought it was pretty great when I had it. They uh, moved up so much into the mid range smartphone market and I bought a Samsung Galaxy Apollo. Uh, it was called something else in the rest of the world. Uh, Samsung Galaxy 3, yeah. Samsung Galaxy 5, Samsung Galaxy. I can't remember, but a uh, Samsung Galaxy Apollo, that's what I had. In the chrome mirror finish. And then I had another Samsung, I had a Samsung Galaxy Nexus. Which was again an, a, a great phone, my first high end smartphone. And I love that, but unfortunately I sold it to pay for my LG Nexus 4, which I adore. It's seriously amazing. The phone I had moved up the phone scale pretty quickly, because I had my W350i for about a year, my Galaxy Apollo for about a year, my LG Nexus, not my LG, my Galaxy Nexus for about two years, and my, now I've got my LG Nexus 4 for about... Uh, when did I buy it? December. December, January, February, March. Four months I've had it. Not broken yet. Uh, I'm happy to report. And I hope I've not jinxed, jinxed, jinxed it now by saying that, but... It's a new dawn, it's a new dawn. I'm so sorry. Okay, I can turn the screen screen off again. Turn my light. I'm going to go, so if the rest of you could just move out the way, that'd be great. And I'm going towards the Dijon mustard, I see. Maybe we can stop off and pick up some mustard on the way back. I don't like mustard, but I'll buy it for w someone else that likes mustard. I don't know, if you like mustard, leave me a comment. Or an email. Just email me. I like mustard. And I'll send you a picture of some mustard back, and you can go... Oh, I love that picture of mustard, thank you. And you can tell all your friends that Matt TV sent me a picture of mustard. Go watch his videos on YouTube, he's great. Of co but of course you'd be saying that, not me. Gotta drive carefully, I think, coming up. Oh, we're going on the motorway soon, I think. And we're gonna need to because we need to sleep. And I need to check... Okay, this is annoying me. I've just looked at the clock and it was in regular mode, so I need to change it back to 24 hour clock. No thank you. And then I need to check when we are due to deliver. We are due to deliver at... Friday, 7.48. So I think we have enough time to, well it's Wednesday, so I think we have enough time to sleep. Unlike the last video where I had to sleep and then we were like so late that it's unbelievable. I'm not sure whether I should turn this down because you guys are like struggling to hear me. I don't know. We're going a bit fast I think, let's slow down, we've got to turn soon. Oh, there's a toll booth. Everyone's favourite thing. Cars in this game. Gosh. They are literally just like... Drives in real life, like idiots. Drives in this like game are morons. Okay, so there's like two booths here. But one says trucks only, and one says trucks can't go there, but you can still use both. Okay, let's just go into this one, because I can't be bo bothered to wait. They're going to be like, oh, you're not allowed to here, and I'll just be like, oh, well, I couldn't be bothered to wait. Don't be hating. How much is it? Oh, this one's free, but the next one costs money. Thank you. 
That the change in noise that thrust the pedal to the metal, you know, the pedal to the plastic. I need to think of a funny video title for this video. Pedal to the plastic. Yeah, I think that'd be good. Oh, if I hit something. I'm not looking, I'm trying to look. Okay, no, we're okay. We're gonna need to sleep real soon. I think it's becoming night, but I can't be sure. Oh yeah, it's 6.34pm. Okay, let's just change something before the car behind me can get in. And we'll just turn on our safety lights. Because it's becoming night, but it's not light yet, so we don't need our front lights on. Ooh, and I think I think no, it's not F three. I need F three. F four. Okay, here we go. You can turn on. Okay, we need to turn on front and roof auxiliary. Auxiliary. But I think with the beacon on, if we go. Oh look, you can see at the front. The lights are flashing. I don't know whether you can see that or not, but the lights are flashing at the front. I'll show you when it turns to night. That might be in the next episode. Okay, so I'm gonna go to. I think we've got 20 minutes more, so it's been half an hour, because I looked at the clock, it's like 10 minutes after we started, and it said half past, and now it's 41 minutes past. Oh, that guy just overtook me, and I'm not going fast enough for you! Am I not going fast enough for you? Oh, look at that sun, oh, drifting because I wasn't concentrating. What's the speed limit? Uh, 110. The thing is, I don't know how far long a kilometre is. I know it's like a thousand metres. Pretty sure it's a thousand metres. But ninety, okay. Um I know how long a, like roughly how long a mile is. Like with a kilometre, I've like no idea. I know how long a metre is, but I just can't visualise in my mind how long a kilometre is. And people say, oh, it's like three quarters of a mile, or a mile and three quarters, and it's just like, no, I, I still can't visualise that. I know how long a mile is, but I can't visualise. Maybe it's just me, maybe I'm just, like, stupid, but I don't know. It's just something that I go through on a day-to-day. -day. Oh, I thought I'd been charged for this now, but Travis Tim got 1,500 pounds. 1,900 pounds, yeah, that's even better. Driver Tim has been... Such a good driver recently. Okay, let's see. How long till the nearest rest station? Oh wow. Quite a what long way. Not until nearly in Paris. Oh look, look at this. The whole east west side of France. France? Fra the whole west side of France is completely empty. It'd be nice to go down to Spain. Sorry, sorry. Just looking at the map. I'm meant to be driving. That's what you came here to see. It's been a while since our next rest drop. Oh, we're already yawning. We're already yawning. We're already yawning. It's not a good sign. Can't turn. Thank you, truck. Bad response there. But it doesn't matter. I think there's a bridge coming up. I see a bridge in the distance. The pedal is literally to the plastic right now. I am going so much metal right now. I don't know what I'm talking about. I think there's a crew control though. And I want to try and activate it. Oh no, X is wipers. I mean, triangle is wipers. X. X. 
was meant to be the button acting, but it's not working. Nope. And I've just slowed completely down in the river motorway, but who cares? And I'm gonna get fined so much now for not sleeping. Yeah, so, I have a Twitter account, I have a Twitter account, uh, at MattBTV1, I have a Steam account, add me on Steam, uh, Matty B, I think it is, with a capital M and a capital B, Matty B. Me too. Oh, damn my people, I have a da damn, damn my people account, it, I think it's MattBTV1, MattBTV, I don't know, add me on it, I'll chat to you guys. Um, what other methods? Facebook slash TV fans. Other YouTube channels: MapBTV2, TV Gaming, TV One. Oh god, I think it's red. He really needs to sleep. Um. What else? Um. Do I push on that? Although I don't use it very much. Um, I can't think of what else. Huh. Sorry, I yawned. It's been a stressful week. Actually, it really hasn't, but I'm just tired for some reason. I'm always tired, let's be honest. Awesome not, awesome not, I am driving a big truck. We are driving to Sheffield. It is in the United Kingdom. Do, 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 do. That's not my best singing voice. You'll never hear my best singing voice. But some people will, because I ha am performing in Les Mis. L Les Mis at the Trinity Arts Centre, Gainsborough, on the 13th of July. Oh. If you wish to come. See it, tickets are available from trinityartscentre.com, I think it is, or trinityartscentre.co.uk. Or just search in Trinity Arts Centre Gainsborough, and you can book tickets online or you can call the box office. If you tell me that you come in and comment, I will personally come and see you and be like, Oh, hi there! And you can be like, Oh, hi! And I'll be like, Hey! How are you? And you'll be like, oh, I'm good. I'll be like, did you enjoy the show? And you'll be like, yeah, I enjoyed the show. I loved it. And I'll be like, yeah, of course you did. <laughs> I'll be really big-headed. I won't. If you come, I'll be super nice. I'll make an effort. That sounds really bad. I'll make an effort. I try to be nice, but some people, they just prevent you from being nice and nice people can say all they want about be nice to everyone but there's just some people that you cannot be nice to you may not want to hear this but it's true <sighs> most of you will know a person in your life that you just struggle to be nice to you can have a conversation with them you hold a conversation with them like and listen talk, but you just can't bring yourself to say nice things about them. Then other nice things would include things like, oh, I like them, oh, we'll come up to a rest stop, rest stop already. I like them, they have, they have hair, I like them, they have two eyes on their head. Like, really ridiculous, oh, hard shoulder, really ridiculous um, compliments like that. Oh, oh your skin, oh, that's a good compliment. Oh, your, your, the ag looks on your shoes look lovely today. Has anyone seen that episode of Phineas and Ferb? Ag looks? Oh, have I seen that song? Uh, L, A, G, L, E, T, don't forget it, or something like that, I don't know. 
Ooh, we can sleep now, or we can get petrol further up. Okay, we'll just sleep now. We need to sleep, or I'll get fined large sums of money. And this Rayburn truck in front is like going to be getting up all in my grill. Indicate, please. Thank you. <sighs> yes, I know we're tired. We are turning off now to find a parking spot. Oh, avoid sleeping offence. Shut up. Let's be sleepy sleepy. Right. Find the sleepy sli sleepy sleepy space. I kinda don't want to sleep next to that truck in case like robbers come and then they target his truck and then they see me and they're just like, oh we'll target this truck as well. Don't want that to happen. We've got goods in actually they can't cut into this, it's like chemical. So I should have I should have gone there. We could have had a chat. Engine is the engine out? Now it is. And then there's a train going past, but we missed it. I want to try and do it so there's no night driving like involved, because that is when I crash the most. And after that nice refreshing sleep in the front of a lorry, we are on the road again. I wish there was some commercially available road-like road trucking songs. Actually, 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 I know there is because, well, it's not commercially available, but K, K -indy, Korean indie music, there's this great song and it's like road driver music and I'm not sure if it's commercially available but I best not use it in case I get arrested this is a long trip okay I've decided now I'm definitely gonna split this part up into two parts so in a minute after we've got ten minutes because I'm going to time, like, kind of half an hour. It's probably going to end up being like 40, 50 minutes, but we're going to split it up. And, yeah, you'll be able to watch the next part. And I've got the ultimate upload schedule. I'm going to, going to record and render in the day and then upload at night while I'm sleeping because it takes four or five hours to upload. And you can't upload and do other things at the same time, because I don't want to slow it down. Oops. So, that's my plan of action. Render, play in the day, upload at night. So, you'll be getting uploads that are like, while I'm asleep. So, if you post a comment, I'll definitely definitely reply when I wake up or when I get home from uh, going out to school and other places but it won't be immediate which I apologize for but that's just how it works yeah that's just how it works I love this game Ooh, I did a bad thing now I love this game so much People think like simulators are boring, but I really like them. People are just like, oh, you're just driving a truck. Oh, yeah, it's just like, you're so stupid. Why did you pay like 12 quid for this? 12 pounds. And you're just like, um, I like them. I don't find it annoying. People who play simulator games, I think they have to have like a better imagination. Than people who don't play simulator games. But that's not like a bad thing for people who don't play simulator games. You may have like a good imagination, but I just think you have to have a good imagination to play these games. Because you have to imagine like you're you want to do the job. You have to imagine in the first place like, oh I want to be a train driver, oh I want to drive trucks, oh I want to sweep streets. I think you have to be like, I don't know, I think you have to be like a very open person open personality, accepting 
I don't know why, but I just feel that those are the qualities that you need to be able to enjoy a simulator game. But maybe not. Maybe I'm just talking completely like idiot talk. And none of that is applicable, and everything I've just said is a complete waste of time. Which is probably what's going to happen, because that is what happens most of the time when I speak. Most of the time when I speak, it's complete nonsense, and nobody really cares. I'm not lonely or anything. Or am I? <laughs> no, I'm not. I have good friends. Well, most of the time they're good. Nah. If I didn't have these people that I, like, are my friends, then I would be so lonely. And even, like, even if they don't, like, listen all the time and they don't like listen to everything I say like just hanging around them and having them include you and stuff like that is good I think everybody needs at least one friend someone they can talk to like one really really good friend or at like one or two really really good friends and then the rest of the people you don't really have to be really good friends but you can become good friends with them. And if you want to become really good friends with them, then that would just happen. If you, like, are compatible, then you would just become really good friends. Like, I've recently just started, like, hanging around with people. Like, uh, it's about, I don't know, about a year ago now that we started, like, hanging around. And at the beginning, I was a bit apprehensive. Like, I'm sure they were too. Like, I don't know what these people are going to be like. But then they turned out okay. is good. Yeah. So, I think I'm going to come off now. So, no, actually, we'll go a bit further. Oh yeah, we'll stop now. So, we will escape, and we will, s I, we, I, I will see you next time. So, thank you for watching, and I will see you next time when we complete this mission. So, we'll save this game, uh, Trucker Matty, and I will see you next time. Thank you for watching. Bye!